swing a ding ding. Nymphomaniac. So there's a few people around. That's okay. Kind of expect that. Uh, so yeah, I'll find out where these guys are fishing and go somewhere else. Okay, pretty sure I can see fish in here. Pretty sure. They're in there. Just go a little deep. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty good on the depth. But uh, just make sure. It's a pretty sweet drift. There we go, there's one. Boy, took some took some work actually. To be honest. Whoa. Came clean out the water then. Cool, cool, cool. That's it. Come on in here. There we go. Man, strong little tacker. Just a cool little fish. Awesome. Let's get you back. Nice. Okay, okay, okay. That's the line. Good. That look good. That's a fish. Feels like a better fish too. I guess there's a good fish in this in this river at the moment. Again, I'm just trying to go for the shallow water rather than try and deal with them in the fast stuff. You know. Come on. Oh, that's a good fish. Wow. Woo. Friends, buddies, pals, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. A wintry, rainy, well, soon to be rainy winter's day. Uh, pretty good start there, right? Eh? Uh, I had to work a little bit to find those fish. Uh, the first couple of pieces of water I fished, I couldn't couldn't even buy a bite. So I moved around a little bit and then, uh, yeah, found those couple of fish. So we're off the board. We're not going to get skunked today. So I've just dropped down a little bit further. Going to look in this piece of water over here. See if I can find anything out of here. And then I'm just going to start moving around. I'd like to catch something on the swing. I'm not going to lie. I've got the swinging rod with me. Um, but I'm not opposed to, you know, nymphing up a couple of fish too. So we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Whew. Some good fish around. Let's see if we can get one. Another one. Pretty sure I can see some fish over the back there moving around. Little smudgy and mobile. Mobile smudges. A little bit further over. Yeah, we like this one. Right about there. Mm. High stick, yes, that's one of them. Just trying to get that drift right. Oh, that's not. Oh no, that's just a good fish. Oh, and he's off. Shit. That was a good fish. That was a good fish. Yep, there's one. Um, whoa, it's a silver fish. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, just strong. God. Took some work. Nice 
nós. Man, it was a, it was a spicy little meatball. Uh, yeah, it took me ages to find that fish. Uh, like every fish today, actually, I think. Took this little natural uh, red dot clear drift egg from uh, MZ Fishing Flies. So the water's a little bit clearer today, so I kind of went a bit more subtle uh, after getting nothing to start with. Maybe it made a difference, maybe it didn't, I don't know. Then we've got the Helios 3 6 weight F. Popeye, Mirage LT size 2 reel, and then on there is the scientific anglers amplitude infinity smooth line as per usual in a six weight. And then I've got about 13 foot of uh, straight through leader 3x all the way through, down to a piece of 4x. Simon's ugly, bit of split shot, egg, indicator. You know, the usual winter kind of get up around here. Okay, time to relocate. So, run I was wanting to swing originally and again. Uh, they're still fishing it, so we'll leave them to it and we'll go somewhere else. We'll go downstream, uh, try and find some swingable water. Maybe leave the nymph rod in the truck, so I'm not tempted to do that. One or two in the swing will top the day off pretty nicely, to be honest. So yeah, walk back, go for a drive, go for a walk, try and swing up a fish or two. We'll go one, start with one, just one. It's all I want, just one. That's what we came for, just one of them. <laughs> Chunky monkey. Oh yeah, that's a great fish. Great fish. Look at that man. Perfectly hooked. Oh, that was a fish. Yeah, it was a nudge. Ooh. <laughs> Push that out. That was, that was a bad cast. I nearly fell over, nearly fell in. Got the line caught around my fingers. <laughs> oh, look, just got hit by a fish. <laughs> Still there. Come on, eat it, eat it, eat it. Oh. Okay. Change of fly, something that's a little bit smaller. So we've had a few nudges now with no real kind of <coughs> proper take. So I wonder if they're just nipping at it. It's just a little bit too, just a bit too big for them. Main's finally here, which is, which is alright. I'm okay with that. Oh yeah, straight away. Oh, damn it! I believe I just lifted the rod tip a little bit early, got a bit excited, and it cost me that fish. But yeah, first drift with the slightly smaller, different coloured fly. Interesting. That's a fish, no way! 
Mr. Fish. I was just stripping in to get going again and uh, fish ate it. Whoa. That's a fish. Yes, yes. Oh yeah, come on, come on. Stay on, stay on. Okay, okay, okay. Still solid too. Yeah, that feels heavy. All right. There's fish all the way through here. Under the oh, what a beautiful fish! That is just solid. Oh, yes, oh, what a great day! This has turned out to be wow, look at you. There we go, there we go. Oh, wow. yeah. See you, lady. How fat was she? Ha! That's... That's super cool. That's so cool. This has turned into a brilliant day. That's a fish. Yeah. Oh, there's that fish. Nice. Whoa. That guy is out of here. Oh, dude. Dude. Ridiculous. What a beautiful fat fish. Just condition. Amazing. Oh yes. Just another stonking fish. Go. Make more of you. I'm just gonna give you a quick rundown of what I'm using today for the swing. It's the Orvis Clearwater 11 foot 4 4 weight. On here I've got the Mirage LT size 3 reel. So a size bigger than I use on my nymph rod. On here I've got the Scientific Anglers Integrated Skagit line 270 grain and intermediate sink tip. On the end of that I've got a 10 foot sonar sink tip, which is a 6 inch per second, I think. Yep, yeah, 6 inch per second. And then I've got about that much 1x, about 12 pounds, absolute supreme fluorocarbon tippet. And I change over to this little brown intruder style fly from uh, Flycraft, I think. Uh, and that's it, super simple. That's pretty, pretty solid, this fish. I'm going to follow it down from a little bit here. Uh, my GoPro SD card just ran out. Tippet.
gonna make this quick because it's raining, but uh, that's a fish to end on. Stoked, I'll see you back at the truck. Day done, and what a good one it turned out to be. Yeah, it turned out to be a real good decision to come down here and just take the swinging rod, because just, I find if I take the nymph rod as well, I'm kind of always tempted to just, just do a little bit of nymphing here and there, and you don't put as much time into the swinging, and you just, you don't get enough practice, you don't get really any better, and you don't really catch any fish. Well, not as many fish as you could, so. If you really want to kind of get better at something, just don't give yourself the option to fish any other way, and then that way you kind of force your hand and you're gonna get better. But yeah, it was really cool, man. Caught some quality fish today. Super stoked about that. I mean, it doesn't really get any better than that. And to catch some of those on the swing, I mean, phew, that's just, that's pretty much what I wanted to do. So mission accomplished. Sorry about the lack of B-roll. Not the kind of day to have the big camera out much because it kept raining on and off and that kind of stuff. But hopefully you saw enough good fish to make it worth your while watching. I'm gonna get out of here. Give me a thumbs up, drop me a comment in the comment section below and all that good stuff. Great to see you guys, have a great week. I'll see you on the next one, peace.